subscribe and press the bell icon to get notified for the latest tech videos. Hey what's up YouTube this is Wase here and today in this video I'm going to show you how you can resolve the error 4000 on your Apple devices when you are trying to update them. So I'm going to show you in complete detail how you can resolve this error. So let's begin the video. So before I begin to tell you how you can resolve this error I should tell you that most probably this error or error 4000 occurs on your Apple devices when you are trying to update the iOS of your iPad, iPhone or iPod using iTunes. So this is the case when you are most probably going to encounter this error and a box will appear up and it will say your device cannot be updated and unknown error occurred and it will say 4000. So this is the problem that you are going to encounter and I have encountered that same problem myself and I have resolved this. So I am going to show you how you can do this. So here I have connected my iPad to iTunes and I am pressed on the update button to start the update process. So here I will just press on update to begin the update process. So from here everything will work alright. It will first extract the software then it's going to back up our iPad and after that it will start installing the software on our iPad but when it reaches the installation part I will get an error message on iTunes and it will say that the iPad this could not be updated and unknown error occurred 4000. So this is the error that you are going to encounter when you are going to update the iOS of any of your Apple devices using iTunes. So in order to solve this process it's very simple. So what I'm going to do is now I'm going to show you the iPad in which I want to update. There are some options that you need to disable during this process so let me just show you that first of all you all you need to do is to open the settings of any of the apple device in which you want to update here you need to first go to display and brightness here you can see it says auto log and it's at two minutes you're going to press on it and you're going to set it to never that's the first thing now we're going to go back now we need to go to our touch id and passcode settings so first of all we are going to enter the passcode of this particular device after entering the touch id and passcode section here it says turn passcode off we are going to press on it we are going to again enter the passcode of this particular device and now it's going to just turn off passcode of this device so these are the only two things that you need to do with any of the ipad or iphone or anything which you want to update and you're not being able to update so now you can simply plug in the lightning cable to one end here and the other end to your mac or windows pc and now when you update it through itunes then you will not get the error that uh, an unknown error occurred 4000 and if i show you you can see that i'm currently running ios 14.4 on this particular device so if i go to the about section here you can see software version is 14.4 which is currently the most latest version available for ipad os during the recording of this video so guys if you like this video please give this video a thumbs up if you have any kind of questions regarding this video write them in the comment section below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so i have made other videos regarding apple devices in the past as well if you are interested in them do check them out in my channel other than that thank you for watching and stay safe